a statistical question can ask about an entire set of data that can vary or value that describes a set of data. For example, what is the height of the tallest person in my class is a statistical question because it will tell you the greatest value of a set of data that can vary. You will learn other ways to describe a set of data later in this chapter. For example, you see the different heights of the people. You're measuring each person and then finding the greatest value of height. So it's a lot of information. Bongos are a kind of antelope that live in Central Africa. Bongos are unusual because both males and females have horns. Write two statistical questions a biologist could ask about a group of bongos. The first one says, what is the length in inches of the horns on the bongo that has the longest horns in the group? Different bongos will have different horns lengths. This question asks about the value of a set of data that can vary. So it is a statistical question. A second question they could ask is, what is the weight of the smallest bongo in a group? Different bongos will have different groups. Well, different bongos will have different weights. This question asks about the value in a set of data that can vary. So it is a statistical question also. On this page, it says a researcher knows the amount of electricity used in 20 different homes on Monday. How much electricity does the house that uses the most electricity use? Could be a question a researcher would use. Question B. A museum director records the number of students in each tour group that visits the museum during the week. So a question you could ask about that would be, how many students are in the smallest tour group? For this page, you're identifying the statistical question and explaining your reasoning. What is the low temperature in Chicago at the end of the day in March? What is the low temperature in Chicago on March 7th? Question A asks for the low temperature at 31 different times for each day of March. And it is likely that the temperature will be different each night. Question B only asks for one specific temperature. So that is not the, a statistical question. Here's another question. Which one is statistical? How long did it take you to get to school this morning? So it's only asking about one time. Or B, how long did it take you to get to school each morning this week? Question B asks you for multiple information on different days. So the times could be different depending on which way you went to school, if there was traffic, if you were on time. So that is more of a statistical question because it has more information. Now try this one on your own. Good luck. Let me know if you have any questions. It says, a student recorded the number of pets in the household of 56 graders. So what is a question you could write about that? Here is the summary. You need to read each question and figure out if they are statistical questions or not. The first one is how many minutes did Ethan take to complete his homework last night? So just one night. How many minutes did it take Madison to complete her homework each night? So many nights. How many more minutes did Andrew spend on homework on Tuesday than Thursday? And what is the longest amount of time Abigail spent on her homework this week? So all five days. And here's your homework. 